What's going on, YouTube? It's Rubber Ducky here. We're back in episode four of the Axis campaign for Close Combat 2. There's been a ton of feedback and support in the comments, so keep that stuff coming. It all helps me grow as a creator to ensure I'm taking steps forward, as well as improve my gameplay and have a little bit more fun. If you're new to the channel or the series, the Allied campaign is complete and can be found in the Close Combat Allied playlist. If you need to get caught up on the three previous episodes of the Axis campaign, there's a playlist for that too. Consider clicking the subscribe button and stay up to date on my ducking content. It's 1200 on day one, and 15th Army is holding Vehill Bridge and hoping to bog down the Allies at this crucial crossing. This is a vital area to the Allies because 30 Corps and its supplies must pass through here. Take it and you will seriously delay their progress. It will be difficult to stand up to the force of 30 Corps when they do arrive, but you will have opportunities to counterattack. Hold the bridge for as long as you can, then blow it up. Once you do, you will need to retreat to the town. If you cannot blow the bridge, regroup and make a stand somewhere else down the road. Well, it looks like we're totally set for this battle. We've got one point and one MG42. I tell you what, I have more faith in buying a 20-year-old rental car sight unseen than I do in holding this bridge. This should be great. Let's see what happens. Okay. Please bear with me while I get all of these units organized and properly positioned. I actually kind of like this guy up here in the farm. And... Let's see, I think he can see the bridge pretty decent from that building. Yeah, I mean, if they crawl across, he can lock them down. That hedgerow will be a little bit of a problem, but hopefully we can stop them on the bridge. Uh, there's nowhere else to get cover. So it kind of just is what it is here. Surely they're going to be here any second, right? I mean, it's been almost a minute, I feel like. We still got to hold this thing for 10 more. Oh, there they are. Open up. Soon. There we go. Okay. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. It's a bloodbath. This is perfect. Except for the one guy that's going to get across. All right. We lost sight of him. All right. Get some suppressive fire out there. We're just going to see if we can get him to crawl back or, you know, not keep going. All right, hang on to that ammo for a minute. Where else are you guys hiding? Okay, there he is. Open up on him. Okay, we got another team down there. Just behind him. How can they see me? I can't see them. Oh. Up here, top of the bank. All right. All right, prioritize the guys on the bridge. Oh, come on. Where are they? Oh, come on. Come on. I'm pretty sure there's a BAR squad that's already across. They're not shooting at me, though, if they are. Come on, guys, kill somebody. There we go, that guy's dead. He, he wasn't going to make it. As soon as he stood up, I had faith. Little, but I had faith. All right, rifle. Can we get one or two of them? Okay, we lost a guy. That's a third of our fighting force. This is not going good. Yellow, black, yellow, yellow, yellow. No good targets. There's a good target. Oh, yep, yep, rifle team, they're across. I wonder if the BAR squad right next to the bridge crawled back and was not actually crossing it. But it definitely looked like they were going to go for it. Okay, one down. All 
All right, looks like we are a third of the way or so through the ammo. Okay, another one. Lost sight of that team. Back on the VAR. Okay, somebody's crawling back across the bridge from that rifle team. Somebody else was crawling up the bridge. I think that's a different team. We're still about half. All right, so that rifle team's dead. Um, we got to sit tight for a minute because we cannot seem to hit them behind the hedges. Half of our remaining squad is retreating. Uh, get these guys that are running. Oh! Come on! Yeah, they're just going back. We got a lot of bodies piled up there. Okay, watch out for the 30 cal browning. Let's knock them out real quick. Uh oh, that just said we're conserving ammo. We're only halfway. Keep shooting. Why is homeboy using his uh, his pistol? You're not gonna hit them with that. Don't don't load your pistol. There you go. MG42. Out of ammo, we have a third of the ammo remaining. A third of our ammo can't be pistol ammo. What is going on? All right. Troop status is all yellow now. Um, Hearth fled in panic, and he's he's not doing good. We're, we're about to have to pull back out of here. We definitely can't do anything with this pistol. That's not going to be a thing. Need to keep them bottled up here as long as possible, though. We got five minutes still remaining on the bridge. And they are just going for it. Oh, man. I guess I should have been more conservative. I thought I was though I'm looking at the ammo thing thinking I've got plenty of bullets left I clearly didn't so question that ammo refers to like the entire team I'm guessing but so that includes um, like the the Mauser ammo and our our leader that died whatever he was carrying the mp40 I think you had an mp40 it's that ammo too and the MG42, and I guess, like, are they all equal thirds? Like, if I'm, you know, a third out of the ammo with the machine gun, does that show up as, like, you know, I'm, I'm a third out of the ammo in the bar, if that makes sense? So, yeah, I'm going to have to watch that more carefully, because that ammo went fast. We're going to pull back further. Let's do this. Come on. It's almost there. And blow. And of course. So I'm guessing if they hold the bridge, that affects my ability to blow it. We got one more minute to hold on. We'll try it again. Yeah, I'm not even sure if he's going to be able to take it or not, but... Dude, heading for safety. No, you don't head for safety. You go over here and you take the bridge back. Okay, yeah, but anyway, I'm not sure if I can even get it back with this one guy. It just kind of depends on where they went. If they crawled across it and kind of chased after me and went north, we might be able to just sneak in there, get off the bridge, and blow it. Uh, he's doing okay. 
All right, you can you can take a break in a minute, dude. You need to keep moving. He knows I'm sending him in there to Rambo this one man against the whole army. Oh, don't do that. So I think we're just going to sneak all the way there. Now, that, as soon as he gets to this hedgerow, we don't want to get spotted. Nope. That's that's really just not going to work. All right. Can we get in there from the north? Uh, he's panicking. It's not even going to follow the orders. He's just going to run away. Yeah, we're just going to have to call for the ceasefire. I'm not going to lie. I kind of didn't expect that they would take that. We are 75 out of zero progress. So as bad as that was, it still turned out okay. We're also going to take the one hour ceasefire option and try and hit him again around the farm. We kind of wrecked him. 25 KIA to hour one. But things I'd like to do differently, I would want to remember to call the ceasefire sooner. It's still a new tactic to me, so it didn't even cross my mind until the end. Um, it looks like Hart was the only coward, but we're gonna we're gonna give him that one because the three of these guys stared down, you know, the whole American army, and you know that that's understandable. Um, Tila, it looked like had 23 kills and. We've got some serious destruction on them. Look at that, like tons of NCOs and even like full squads. Like we put the hurt on them pretty good. Of course, they're a mortar team with the one lucky shot that hit our squad leader. So that's going to wrap this one up. We'll be revisiting this battle soon. I'm looking forward to your thoughts here. So leave a comment down below. If you're not already subscribed, now's a good time to click that ducky in the bottom right corner. Thanks for watching. See you soon.